It's been a long time, but my time is finally near, and I'll see my dream come alive at last. I can touch the sky, and they're not gonna hold me down, no, no, they're not gonna keep me down, because I've got faith of the heart. I'm gone with my heart. Oh, <laughs> hi, welcome to Lord JS. Yes. And a video about guitars, yes, indeed. Uh, though I, I won't be able to actually show you what I'm talking about physically right here, because I don't have the those guitars. But uh, still, some people ask me uh, sometimes, what's the difference between the Gibson ES335, ES345, and ES355? Well. While, th while those three guitars definitely are similar, there are differences between them. Uh, the base model, if you wish, is the ES-335. And the very popular original, yeah. It's a semi-hollow, thin line, uh, arch-top kind of guitar, which is electric uh, guitar, and it has two humbucking pickups, which are usually covered, though some people take off the covers and use them open coil but um, usually from the factory they are uh, covered yeah and it's a semi hollow so it has the center block of wood down the center on the inside where the pickups and stuff are mounted to and also the bridge and tailpiece and stuff yeah and it's hollow on the side and it has f holes yeah set neck Originally, for tailpiece, it was either available with a uh, Bigsby or a stop bar tailpiece, yeah. Later on, uh, they also introduced uh, the trapeze tailpiece, similar to the trap, the same tailpiece used on the ES330 and uh, the Epiphone Casino, yeah. But originally, it was either the Bigsby or the stop bar, yeah. Uh, then we have, uh, and also these guitars have a freeway toggle and a two volume and two tones, as far the no as, as far as the knobs as far as the knobs go, yeah. And on these, the uh, freeway toggle is not positioned up on the horn like it is on a Les Paul, instead it's the freeway toggle is down along with the uh, knobs instead, yeah. The ES345 is a step up, so it's a, so it's a bit more high end than the 335. It has different inlays on the fretboard because I forgot to tell you, uh, the ES335 the base model either has just a dot inlay or the small uh, blocks. Yeah. On the 345, you get the split parallelograms, similar to the, or actually more pretty much the same inlays that you see on a, on a standard Epiphone Dove acoustic or a Gibson Dove acoustic. Sorry, and also on the Gibson Hummingbird standard acoustic, and a few others. Yeah such as the uh, Country Western and uh, the uh, Southern Yambo, yeah, those inlays. And you also get, and the major difference though, is that you get the, the Varitone switch, yeah, which, because the 45 and the 55, unlike the 335, which is just standard regular mono, Originally, the 45 and the 55 were stereo, so you had to have the stereo cable to plug in, so you could get, well, when you had both pickups on, you get one pickup sent to one amp and one to the other, yeah. So, and, and you also had the Varitone switch, which is a special switch that clicks from position 1 to position 6. One is the bypass, so 
the baritone is completely off and then and you hear just the guitar as it is and then you and the other position and the other positions cut away some frequencies so the sound get a little bit thinner as you go along yeah so. and also usually uh, you get gold hardware on the uh, 45s yeah. still a rosewood board though you know, just like the 335 uh, there were some occasionally have, have been ebony fretboard but usually they're not so but and then we get to the 355 which is the uh, highest model uh, so it, uh, it's all gold hardware it is a fully bound headstock with the uh, big arrow head split diamond inlay just like on a last ball custom and full ebony board and like I said gold hardware and uh, mo thick multiply binding and stuff like that so, yeah. also tail pieces for the 45 are pretty much the same once available as, as, as for the free as for the free 35 so it's either stop bar or Bigsby later on trapeze I don't know some of them can sometimes be uh, the maestro uh, bar system yeah and all of those are also available for the free for the for the highest model the 355 though those can also be sometimes found with the sideways Gibson Vibrola as well yeah so and as far as the fretboard inlays on the highest model the 55 you get the large blocks the large block inlays uh, instead of the smaller blocks like you see on like you can see on some 350, 335s and the, or the split parallelograms as the 345s yeah so the, the 55 have the large blocks yeah so 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 that's like the basics regarding the differences between the 335 the 345 and the 355 yeah but they're all a semi hollow yeah using the same scale length and uh, body shape yeah and they're all set necks and uh, two humbucking pickups yeah thank you for watching this video about the Gibson ES guitar yeah have a nice day viva la revolution and i'll see you all in the next video whatever it might be